need the rest to do the job. All right, welcome to this episode of my playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn. We are back in Meridian. Uh, we've been doing a bunch of side quests, and we've uh, I think we've completed most of the side quests from like the southern area of, of Karja territory. And now I've decided it's time to progress the main mission, the the main story. So uh, we're gonna head over to. Um, uh, what's his face is uh, dig site, and uh, we're going to confront him and see what he has to say. Uh, Olin, that's his name. Olin, we're gonna head to Olin's dig site and see what he has to say. Let's get going. Buy what you need, leave the rest. I wonder what this is over here. For that matter, where is the spire? I thought the spire, or the shard, or whatever it was called, was near Meridia. Oh, there it is. There's the, uh, what's its... On this oddly triangular uh, plateau. I do wonder about what this is over here. Maybe a palace of some sort, looks like. The city's become too crowded these days. The whooping like many There are so many guards on this bridge. Always. I mean, granted, the, the head of the guard did just get murdered, so it makes sense that they'd be a little paranoid. Goose don't care. Taking me through cut cliffs, not through the quarry, but down and around. And okay, that's the route you're taking me. Okay. By the sun, I'm alive. Thank you, Nora. I didn't get the kill, but they still gave me the credit. So, sure. I'll take it. For the Sundom! For Meridian! Yeah, yeah. And that is also a long leg right there. They're a bit of a pain to fight. I'm gonna try to avoid fighting it.
And there's just a merchant just hanging out there. So the cultists are here, and just in case you need a bit of a refresher, um, Olin's family is cl is being held hostage, or so the visions we've seen from in Olin's secret workshop tell us, um, and he's being required to do their bidding. So exactly who they are and why, we don't know. Couple guys over there. Looks like a couple corrupted machines over here. Well, I am going to switch to the Silent Hunter because I'm being all stealthy like. I'm trying to be anyway. Something stumbled in that they don't like. Maybe it's the Ravager. I'm gonna take advantage of this opportunity to get closer. Um, don't mind your people just being picked off one by one. That is indeed a Ravager. Looks like it took care of the uh, corrupted machines for me. Very nice of it. Never know when I might need these. I 
don't see any enemies with the focus yet. Does it mean they're not there? It means I don't see them yet. This is oddly creepy. This is what you intend to bring these ancient things back to life. Their power serves us. Machine demons from beneath the ground. It's a nightmare. Nightmares, yes. The worst dreams of our enemies come true. Yes, rise. will destroy us all! They will only destroy our enemies and bring us back the lands that were taken. Ah! 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 Stop working. Search the area. We may have intruders. Forgive this intrusion, Eloy. You left me no choice. <laughs> Who is this? An interested party. Now, the focuses are disabled, but I don't know for how long. The rest is up to you. Who is this? Well, that's a heck of a development. Several hecks of developments, actually. Try and get to the tall grass there without being spotted, of course. Yeah, it's coming this way. Might want to try coming down the other way. be able to do it a bit more incrementally.
anything over here? Not sure what that was! Called the wrong guy by accident. Not alone! Got something. Norgo, this. Kill her! No! You had your chance. To me, brothers. That didn't go very well for Olin. I don't know if I'm allowed to let him die or not. It seems like Olin can't die, he just gets incapacitated for a while. That's good.
I have a funny feeling this pile has the um, ancient vessel that I that I was originally looking for. Yep. Odyssey. Uh, which is a uh, part three ancient vessel. A cracked and battered vessel once dear to the old ones shows stars in the legend Odyssey. Sets of ancient vessels could be traded in radiant for valuable rewards. Yeah, we know. Well, I think it's just the one cultist left. And Olin. To me, let's take her down. Farewell, fool. Cultist up there. And a cultist up there. If you want me to come to you, then I'll come to you, but you won't like it. Still sniffing around. <laughs> Told you you wouldn't like it. That's right. No one here. the other one again? Ah, there we go. Talk to Olin. Oh, you better believe I'm gonna talk to Olin. Hear me out! That was a bit of a weird fight. Didn't quite go the way I think it was supposed to, but, uh... We did it. You came for me. I'm ready. I promise. I'll tell you everything. I know you will. The killers who came for me at the Proving, who are they? The Eclipse. Some kind of holy warriors. A cult of the Shadow Karja. Shadow Karja? Except they're not like any Karja I've known. They don't pray to the sun. They worship some kind of devil. I'm not interested in their superstitions. 
Oh, it's not a superstition. Their devil is real. It has a name, a voice, the most terrible voice, and they do its bidding. So many branches to pursue here. <laughs> what are these Eclipse cultists after besides me? They never said. But given the Karja civil war, they must want to overthrow Sun King of Odd and take Meridian back. What do I have to do with that? I don't know. When they attacked the Proving, a man came for me. Tall, strong, dead eyes. He is. And who is he? The Terror of the Sun. Stacker of corpses, we Asuram called him, when he was the Mad Sun King's champion. <sighs> if only he died with his king. But now he leads the Eclipse. I tell you, he's the most dangerous man alive. I don't doubt that. How did the Eclipse recruit you? I know they took your family hostage, but why you? I was a scrounger, a rummager in dark places, good at what I do. I suppose they knew I would serve them well as a scout. I had taken a delve near Maker's End. When I surfaced, they were waiting. I laughed when I saw the priest. But then he showed me Helis's encouragement. I didn't laugh after that. They gave me a focus to watch my every move. I followed orders. You had access to Meridian. Why didn't they get to Avad through you? Too much dirt under my nails for an audience with the one true Sun King. But whatever Ursa or Aaron told me, the Eclipse heard every word through my focus. That's why I couldn't warn you. If I tried, they would have killed my family. You say this devil, the Eclipse worship, has a name? Hades. That's what they call it. Hades. And you've heard it speak? Steal to my soul, I heard, just once, when it saw you. Such a voice. A cold, awful jangle that scrapes your bones, that hollows your guts. A metal sound, but like nothing dug from the earth or smelted in a forge. And what did it say? System threat detected. Just three words. But in the voice of a devil. Well... That is interesting. Also, Hades? <laughs> Why are the Eclipse digging up ancient machines? And how do they get them to work? I thought they wanted them for scrap, but they brought them back to life. Plugged some kind of device into the corpses so that Hades could whisper to them and call them from their grave. I've fought that kind of machine before. Are there others? Yes. The ones you fought today, they call Corruptors, but there are others, much bigger, bristling with ancient weapons. Those they call Deathbringers. I've only seen them buried in the ground, but after today, anything is possible. Sounds to me like they're raising an army. If so, the world will fall. And I helped dig the pit. Deathbringer has a pleasant ring to it, doesn't it? Now here's the million dollar question. The one I deliberately chose for last because I figured it was going to be a bigger answer. The Eclipse were sent to kill me because I look like another woman. Older, maybe twice my age, short hair. Who is she? I don't know. My focus found her image once in the ruins at Maker's End. Maybe you can find her there. You found her image in the ruins? How? There was a door, beside it, a kind of ancient device that contained the woman's image. My focus recorded the location. You do look like her. Is she your mother? I'm the one asking questions. I've heard enough. It's time to finish this. I won't beg for my life. But if there's any mercy in you, free my family. Please. Where would I find them? My focus recorded the location. There are always guards there. You look like you can handle yourself. One of these emotional choices things. Uh, as I've mentioned, I try to avoid the fist. Your life is forfeit. 
the, at least the way I play, I'm playing Aloy, I tend to either go for the heart or the brain. Olin's a snake. He... He is totally a snake. But I'd be lying if I said I didn't empathize with why he did it. He was really just trying to protect his family. Did terrible things, and he obviously regrets it. But still, did terrible things. I'm a softie. I'm gonna give him the chance to redeem himself. It will take many good deeds to make up for the crimes you've committed. You're sparing me? After all I've done? Yes. Forge a new life, Olin. One of better make. Then the rest of my life will be lived in your dead. Go to the place where your family is being held and wait for me. We'll make their lives the first ones you save. I didn't earn this mercy, but I will die to make myself worthy of it. I will be waiting for you. Glad he appreciates what I did for him. Another day. What'll this one hold? Coincidental timing. <laughs> that line was uh, just because the sun rose. Um, but very appropriate for the situation. I'm glad Olin appreciates what I did for him. Just heal up a little bit. And inventory, what did I get? Uh, Ancient Vessel Odyssey, I knew that one, okay. Uh, oops. And quests, errands, collateral. Olin begged Aloy not for his life, but for the life of his family, held captive by the Eclipse as leverage. Go to the Spur Flints to find where Olin's family are held captive. Where is that? All the way down here, okay. <laughs> oh, it's this weird zig zaggy cliff bit. I've been there. I did the uh, Cauldron Row there. Uh, Maker's End is the other quest I've received. Aloy seeks to learn more about the mysterious woman who looks like her among the crumbling ruins of an ancient city. Where is that? All the way up here. Of course it is. Well, I'm in the area. So I think the next thing I'm going to do is the... Um, robbing the Rich quest, which is right up here. Which is a, a quest I took on way back. It's a Karja nobleman. Uh, his family heirloom sword was stolen. He just wants it back for his heir. We managed to uh, convince people who stole it to uh, return it, but they are making us go get it. So I'm going to head over to this campfire here, and that's where we're going to call an end to the episode. Just me, or does that look like not an art, not a natural tower? That looks artificial, right there. It's this way.
And with that, I am going to call an end to the episode there. Um, wow, some really interesting developments there. Uh, you know the drill. Click over there. And I will see you next time as we see where this leads us, all right? See you then.